Can you just introduce your? Wait, you don't want your name? You're not even your name. No one knows. No one knows your fucking. Okay, what's your name? Uh, bro, what the fuck? Uh, shipping fee. Uh, I I guess you get reimbursed for the shipping fee, so it doesn't come out of your pocket. It comes out from the customer, I guess, right? Uh, I I. I don't know if it comes from the customer. Oh. Well, well, they they usually pay for it, but I don't know if they get reimbursed if they are the ones who cancel it and refuse to accept the item. That's kind of bullshit. They should make a they should make a policy about that. That's kind of bullshit for the seller, you know. They they should they should um and and they need to have a system to detect fraudulent orders. Yeah. Um, because uh, the way it is right now. Anyone can do this. Um, if uh, you don't like a guy and you know the name of his shop, you can just order all of his items and send it to some random place in some island somewhere. Yeah. Uh, and then uh, obviously there won't be anyone there to accept the item. Yeah. And then a few months later, it just gets sent back to him. And he loses all that time and and the effort to pack the item and everything. Yeah, that's total bullshit. Um, when you accept packages in the Philippines, you have to accept by person and you have to like sign a thing, right? Sorry. When you accept uh packages, your 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 shopping items in the Philippines from the courier, you have to accept the package items in person and you have to put a signature like that every time. Yeah. Yes. Okay. You cool. Do. In Korea, How they just. In- in Korea, they just leave it in front of your house. Okay. That's cool. I mean, but what if someone just snatches it? It's, no one does that in Korea. Yes. <laughs> okay. That's, that's, that's why. It probably wouldn't work here. If you leave it in front of the house, someone's going to take it. Yeah, it's, it's gone, right? Yeah. That's the, yeah. That's the, yeah, that's the, that's the big problem. But uh, yeah, thanks. Um, do you have anything you want to say to my subscribers, Filipinos in Tagalog about Lazada and Shopee? So wait, 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 wait. Uh, you started with Lazada, but your Shopee is not doing well or what's going on with Shopee? Sales are a lot uh, slower on Shopee. Cool. So I'm um, more encouraged to work on my Lazada page instead because I, I uh, see the returns there. But mm. on uh, Shopee, it's um, a lot slower. I heard I heard Shopee is much more f- popular and you know the Shopee mall and and there's more sellers there that sell cheap and I, I heard the market share is bigger than Lazada is that right Um if you get promoted by Shopee uh yes you have um there is potential but um so far my experience has not been very good on uh, based on my experience sales on Lazada are stronger but yeah they say uh, Shopee is bigger now um, I don't know why my sales aren't that great. Maybe because you, yeah, maybe because you're not a good person. Have you thought about oh, that? What? Have you thought about that? Maybe you you, you um, just lack prayer. Maybe. Ah. Uh, <laughs> maybe 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 um <laughs> maybe, maybe uh Stoppy is aligned with uh, uh, heaven. Uh, Anyways, you said you make around 150,000, not make, but you said you, you, you do around sales 150,000 pesos, right? Uh, that, that's possible. Yeah. Um, every, so if I, on items, like per item, per day, you'd package like 40 to 50 items, send them out. Um, it, it's less than that. Less than it's that. Less than that. Yeah. 20 to but 30. Uh, some orders have uh, multiple items. So there's that. And you do this all alone, right? Yeah, um, uh, my family helps as well. Do you pay your family, or are you just using your family as a no, logistics? No, well, well, I, I, I contribute to the household expenses, so there's that. What do you contribute to the household expenses? Money. What else? How much? Five hundred pesos per month. What? <laughs> I, I'm not going to share my uh, finances okay, 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 on YouTube. Okay, 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 God damn it. I hope you, okay. Uh, so you're sharing, uh, okay, so basically you're using your parents, uh, their household, their house and everything for your own good. That's what I'm hearing, right? Um, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> I, um, 
it, it's my warehouse. The house is my warehouse as well. Hey, don't so you get don't don't you uh corners, don't you keep my good? Don't you feel a little bit um um like isn't it too much packaging and stuff for for you alone? Like, don't you get a little uh um, over over overburdened to do the packaging yourself? Right now, uh, it's still manageable. But if my uh, business grows, let's say it. Let's say it doubles over the next two years or something. Then I would need to hire someone. But uh, right now it's still manageable, and um, I I don't really need an extra hand. Okay, yeah. if when when it grows and when when you need to hire people, who what are you looking for? Um, because there are a lot of people without jobs, and they're asking me, can I get hired, Paul? Can I get hired, Paul? So really, yeah. Well, um, uh, I, I would need someone who uh, doesn't mind the packing all day because that's basically basically, basically job. Just packing, packing, packing. <laughs> you need a packer, packing, a bag packer. You need a mother packing, pack, packer in that packing Indian <laughs> packing house with that packing guy who doesn't want to share his finances. Of course, you want someone packing cheap, de right? Packing, packing shit. Yeah, right? basically. And uh, they should uh, come to work on time, I guess. Come to walking um, on time, that backpacker, right? Okay. All right, that's nice. Uh, so yeah, message this guy. I don't know. Uh, wait, are you so... Wait. Okay, never mind. You're going to be anonymous anyways because I'm going to be... Uh... Anyways, you don't even... Uh, Bob... What's your fucking name again? Ba- <laughs> Bobby? Bobby? Ah, fuck you. Anyways, um, <laughs> Bob Smith. You don't even... you. Like your quality of your camera is not even good that they can't even like determine who you are. Seriously. Great. Yeah. Great. But anyways, um, yeah. Thanks. Any last thing you want to say to uh, the subscribers out there, or whatever? Um, not really. Good luck, I guess, with whatever you're doing. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Jebal, go go go. Jebal, go go go. Okay. Good. Good. Hi everyone. I'm Carl Ocab and. Uh, I'm the founder and CEO of Carl Alpha Digital Marketing Inc.